What up, North Collectors here with another box break, this time 2018 Tops Finest Baseball. It's been a while since a release like this has come out for baseball. The last one was um, Tier 1, is yep. that right? A tier little one. big release, yeah. Yeah, for yep. a big release. And then before that was Bowman, so it's been there's been a little bit of a drought uh, in the baseball car releases, but this is one we look forward to every year, uh, Tops Finest. Uh, great looking cards you get two autographs per master box one per uh, mini box uh, the set is about 100 base cards uh, you can get purple blue green uh, gold orange and red uh, parallels there's um, various autos <clears throat> uh, there's the finest redemption mystery redemption cards there's uh, short printed cards uh, numbers 101 to 125 uh, so <clears throat> a lot in the set uh, there's insert autographs uh, and there's even uh, throwbacks or flashback autographs as well. So, lots of stuff to look for in here. Stuff out of here. Yeah, Otani's in here. Um, there's all sorts of uh, big name uh, signers, but uh, Finest has been typically a very hard product to hit uh, a big autograph in um, or even a better name. So, uh, there. They're expensive. They're about 150 a box right now. We picked these up for 20% off on eBay, so we saved a little bit of money. But um, <clears throat> even so, 150 bucks if you're going to go to your retail store and you know not be able to uh, get a big autograph out of it, or even a you know 50, 60 dollar autograph means you have a big investment. But the cards are nice, so if you like collecting them and aren't cared so much about the value as far as resale, uh, definitely a fun product to break. Yeah, so we've seen other videos where the autographs in the first pack, so we're gonna just yeah. we'll save it and see. <clears throat> it might not, not be in the first pack; it could be in the second sure, pack. So. It could be we'll see anywhere. Some of the um, boxes will have three autographs in them. Uh, I've seen that before as well. So you have? yep, huh. if there's an insert autograph, it is a thicker card. I'm not sure what it is though. It's like a thicker stock. Uh, so Nick Williams rookie. This is the base design. Really nice looking cards, really sharp. Very shiny. And you can see, like you can see my face in the background, it's so shiny and reflective. So Nick Williams, Carlos Carrasco, and, oh nice, Ozzy Elby's oh, nice. uh, the finest. Top's Finest. This is the finest first rookie. Yeah. This is pretty, this is a thicker stock. This is about a 55 point-ish. Oh, those are nice looking cards. And uh, this card looks pretty awesome like I could see the parallels and the autographs of this looking pretty sweet all right so Ozzy Elby's good name to get Robbie Ray and Chris Davis all right next pack so I don't know it, it seems like you get a couple numbered cards a master box about yeah there's usually. not this is the for the breaks we've seen so far not a lot of color in this no, no. that's pretty cool Mookie Betts for our PC having an awesome year this year Oh, these look nice. Cornerstones, yeah, nice. Nomar Mazar. These are really cool looking. Now, I read, I think it was Cardboard Connection, said these cornerstone cards are from the 1994-95 Finest Basketball release. So huh. this is like a <clears throat> going back to 94-95. Really so pretty cool. Paul Goldschmidt. And yeah, nice. Miguel Andujar, rookie. That's a nice rookie. Sweet. Would love to pull an Otani or rookie card out of this. That would be nice. Yeah, Those are pretty... A, they're not, like, super easy to pull, so that'd be cool. All right, uh, so we got Salvador Perez, Wilson Contreras, and a refractor of Avisil Garcia. These look awesome, too. There's a little shinier than the base card, but Avisil Garcia. Does it say refractor on the back or not? I don't know. I know no, it does it not. I don't, no. Not that I see, so. I mean, they're, it's pretty easy to distinguish what's a refractor and what's yeah, not. Yeah, it is nice when they put it on there, I think. Yeah, but. I agree. Uh, Chance Cisco, another good rookie for the Baltimore Orioles, and Gary Sanchez. All right, next pack. We got Alex Wood. I don't know how. Do you know how he's doing this year? I don't. Dodgers? I know that they have had a ton of injuries, so Mike I and, and especially in their pitching yeah, staff. They have a lot of uh, younger people up. This is cool looking, sitting red. So we've seen these on other breaks, and we if somebody knows what the phrase sitting red means, like we Googled it and still can't figure out what sitting yeah, the red only, actually The only thing means. I can think of is something like about the, the laces, seams on but, the ball, but I have no idea. 
Yeah. Uh, it's like uh, sitting, like waiting uh, for a fastball, maybe. Or yeah, something like I that. think so. I think there's sluggers that are um, in this uh, insert set, and yeah, I think they're just waiting for a good pitch to hit. But let us know. We could be totally off on that. I have no idea. So if you do know, let us know because that's just my best guess here. All right, fifth pack here. Fifth pack in. It's like there's some kind of a sh This might be the auto. I think this is the uh Yeah, I think this is gonna be the autograph. So I'll save that and I'll open up the other pack. Next up, that that pack would be the last pack in the uh, mini box. So Eric Thames, Dominic Smith, rookie. A silver or refractor, not silver refractor. Will Myers, sellers of Panini, term. Uh, Andrelton Simmons and Travis Shaw. All right now to the autograph here. Slide it to the back. Take the cards from the front. So we got uh, Yadier Molina, Elvis Andrus, Kenley Jansen. This card looks really cool. These Cornerstones inserts look yeah, awesome. Yeah, those are really nice. <laughs> Freddie Freeman, Cornerstones. That's really sweet. And our autograph is going to be Yankee rookie Tyler Wade. Huh. Uh, On-card autograph, <clears throat> Refractor Auto. These things look really sweet. Is there a line on that card? There is. Is it really? Do you see it right here? Oh, yeah, there is. It's like a big scratch on the card. Yeah, That's well, awesome. some damage. So we could send that back to tops. I think you can see it right there on the <clears throat> video. Like you can see the line right there. Yeah, that's yeah. no good. <clears throat> Tyler Wade, Refractor Autograph. So yeah, not the name I was expecting. I didn't really look over the autograph checklist too, too and the well, face. So. I kind of thought it was at first Greg Bird just by the face. Like, yeah, I had, I had no rookie. idea. I was like, is it? Gliber Torres, but I don't even think he's in this product. And yeah. Anduhar is, I know that. But the face um, doesn't look like Andy No, Hall. no, I know exactly. So it didn't look like Anduhar. Um, <clears throat> next. He's a Yankee, though. Yeah, Yankee. Tyler Wade, let us know uh, what. So my autograph you was know about the very last pack. All right. I don't know. Next. I think I screwed up opening this box, so I'm not sure what, what it's going to be. Uh, it seems like I out. think that one had an insert in front of it, so. Okay. Yeah, insert and then a shiny card. It might be your own. Yeah, they have these die cuts in here that are um, of Cal Ripken Jr. And then there, some of them are autographed as well. So that'd be sweet. Cody Bellinger, Billy Hamilton, uh, Giancarlo Stanton, refractor. Refractor. Yep. Yeah. Uh, this is uh, Evan Longoria. I think that's his first card in his uh, Giants uniform. Could be. That I've seen. Uh, yeah, unless there's something in... Maybe um, in Tier 1. Tier but... 1, yep. Buster Posey. At least that I have seen. All right, so that just had a uh, refractor in there. Nothing Still, too crazy. No we have not... Yet. Yeah, we haven't pulled a single color card yet. I mean, just the first mini box, but... Yeah. Stuff. All right, Mejia rookie card. And that... Uh, I thought that was a something it's on like the card, bat. but it's just the bat. <laughs> Get out of there. No, just kidding. Stay on their bat. All right. Uh, Alex Verdugo. Like a blue. And this is a blue Matt Olson, number to one fifty. That looks pretty awesome. So that looks really nice. Those are really sharp. Let's see that? Alex Bregman. Parallels. Didn't last and year? Nikki I think Del last Monaco. year how it worked was didn't last year when we opened up like one or two boxes stuff, like all the numbered parallels would be in one mini. Yeah, box. it seemed like to be. Got, that's like, that's right. That's box. right. I think you're right. So. <clears throat> Every case could be different, of course, but yeah, that seemed to be right. Uh, Justin Verlander, but I've been seeing in breaks that I've been watching about one or two colored a box, so not not a lot. Yeah. Uh, so it's Verlander, Keuchel, so back to back Astros. Now it's look at Verlander. That's weird. Is that a Tiger? Yeah, that's a Tiger uniform. Oh, it is. But he's in his... Yeah, I thought it was just the Astros uh, So there's his Tiger's hat, and then he's in his Tiger's uniform with, of course, him on the Astros. You'd think they'd have a picture <laughs> by now. <laughs> that's pretty weird. All right, I wasn't expecting that. Keiko, 
and this is the cool cornerstone Syndergaard. So insert there. I All love right. those cornerstone inserts. They look awesome. Woodruff and a Craig Kimbrell. All right, so three more packs to go. Still looking for our second autograph. And hopefully a Super Fractor. Let's see. All right. Brian Dozier. Uh, Roof Nintendo Door. Marcus Stroman. This is a refractor. Uh, and Paul DeYoung. And Anthony... Rendon. So, so are the Cal Ripken, I think somebody said the Cal Ripkins are uh, two per case. Two I per think, case, right? yep. That's what I saw, yeah. two per case. Um, yeah, they're, they're two per case, and some, some are autographed, and, you know, the I think their autographed numbers are to 10, so they're very short printed. Yeah. Uh, Arenado. So there'd be probably 100 autos-ish in the set total because they're 10. I think so, yep. Yep. Machado. And nice. nice sitting red, Mike Trout. Those insert. cards look pretty cool with the red. Yeah, those cards are those are pretty nice looking cards for insert. And Finest kind of is so looking, but... so shiny. Um, there's a D.D. Gorius and a J.P. Crawford. All right. So so far this box has not been anything too crazy. No, Let's I haven't see. Really gotten much out of it. No, I haven't gotten much out of it. This is honestly pretty <clears throat> average for a finest box. So finest far. is pretty, yeah, pretty much like this. So I think. Ooh, is ooh, that orange? This is yeah. This is looking nice ooh. here. Oh, it's so orange wave. It's maybe an orange wave. So this is going to be low, away. low numbered. Nice. All right. So we have a Reese Hoskins rookie card. Get to focus in a little better. Kind of have to tilt it back a little bit. Yeah. It might, yeah. The, Camera, the, shine, the, the shine shine is, the yeah. Doesn't like to work together. Nomar Mazzara. Brett Gardner. And a Nolan Arenado. All right, let's see what this orange wave is here. We're thinking it's a Diamondback. It could be Goldschmidt. Nope, Jake, Jake Lamb. Lamb. Wow, he's got a nice autograph. All right, so not a big name, but anytime you get an orange yeah, orange wave autograph, uh, definitely not bad. And boy, this is a really nice looking that card. card awesome. Wow. So not a big name, but hey, I'll take a autograph number twenty five. Uh, Lamb, I think last year had a pretty good year. He's a pretty good. Player. Diamondbacks, of course, are always you know kind of out of the limelight, uh, but. Uh, definitely a good player. A 10 out of 25 there. On card autograph of Jake Lamb. So really nice looking card. Uh, these are really sharp. We hit an orange autograph last year. And it wasn't an orange wave. It yeah. was uh, Hayward? No. Yes, Jason Hayward. Jason Hayward, yeah. So uh, definitely nice uh, nice hit there. Once again, not a, not a huge name, but nice yeah, to get a low nice numbered thing. autograph yeah beautiful card yeah it, it's <clears throat> see how hard that is to pull a quick second i'll quick check uh you can show the here's a little hit recap here so we got this matt olson uh orange wave is one every 370 packs the tyler way you only get six packs a mini box that's pretty rough. so one in every how many 360 360 that's a lot of packs, lot of packs. Mm -hmm. uh when you, yeah you only could when you consider it six of packs per mini box 12 packs per box so yeah it takes a lot of packs to get to get an orange wave anyways right, so not too bad of a box overall yeah it wasn't yeah it wasn't it wasn't, wasn't anything but... great no but it, it is finest finest is a really tough product to hit something big out of uh let alone just a seems like one every above two average three auto. cases you yeah. get a really good rookie we we broke two boxes of this last year uh, and we didn't really get a whole uh, bunch got, out like, of it. A couple of Tyler Austins and yeah. uh, a couple other guys. Yeah, we got the there. orange wave of Hayward, but it orange wasn't a, it wasn't a big huge name. But I tell you what, these cards are really nice looking. The, the inserts are are nice. I mean, if you're looking just to put together, um, you know, something for your PC, uh, definitely pick some of these up as singles if you can find a box that's reasonable. Um, definitely a fun break. Um, 
you know, putting these in a binder, um, putting them in your PC. Um, they're they're just a they're a beautiful looking card if you if you're into the chrome uh, finish. So, thanks so much for watching, guys. Hopefully, you enjoyed this break. I believe we have one more box of this coming in uh, that we were able to snag off of eBay on a on the twenty percent off discount. So we were able to get them for just over a hundred dollars, like a hundred and ten, hundred eleven dollars something there. Um, Anyways, uh, hopefully uh, we'll be posting that break soon. Um, and for now, if you enjoyed this break, hit the thumbs up button. Uh, comment below. Tell us what you uh, you liked about this product or what you like about this product. And if you've opened any, what you've uh, got in your box. All right. Um, I think that's it. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet already. Uh, and uh, look for more breaks coming from us soon. We hope to see you then. Uh, thanks so much for watching. Take care. Have a great rest of your night, day, whatever time you're watching this. And have fun collecting. We'll see you soon.